Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for Friday, September 21st. I'm Carlton, and this is my co-host, Daniel. Thanks for joining us today. Monday was the anniversary of a very special day in the history of our country. It's called Constitution Day. In honor of Constitution Day, we have a special game for the very lucky contestants. Let's toss it over to our game show host, Colt. Hi, I'm Mr. American History here, host of Guess That Mystery Document. Here with my three contestants today. Casey. Keenan. Michaela. And your first question of the day is, what is grievance? So, Casey, what is grievance? Um, something sad, like um, when someone dies. Um, I'm sorry, that is not the answer. Um, Keenan, do you have an answer to that question? It's a complaint that the colonists listed in the Declaration of Independence. That is correct, Keenan. One point for you. Bam, bam, bam. Now for question number two. What is a constitution? Casey? I know this one. <laughs> when you have trouble going to the bathroom. I'm sorry, Casey. That's um, constipation. Keenan, do you know the answer to this question? It's a detailed plan of a government. That is correct, Keenan. Two points for you. Bam, bam, bam. The third question of the day is, which grievance in the Declaration of Independence does the Seventh Amendment, the right to a trial by jury address? Casey, do you have an answer? Yes, a matter of fact, I do. Freedom of religion. No. How about you, McKaylee? Um, free speech. No, that's not it either, McKaylee. Do you have an answer to this question, Keenan? Yes. No trials by a jury of peers. That is cor correct again, Keenan. Three points for you. Bam, bam, bam. Question number four. Here we are. Um, how is the king having absolute power addressed in the U.S. Constitution? <gasps> Do you have an answer, McKinley? Um, You could just kidnap him. Uh, no. Uh, how about you, Casey? Oh, you could just say, pretty, 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 please be nice, nice, please. No. <laughs> Well, obviously, the president is limited by the three other branches of government. Correct again, Keenan. You are on a roll. That is four points for you. Bam, bam, bam. Question number five. Here we go. Which amendment in the Bill of Rights addressed the grievance of colonists' homes being searched without warrants? What is your answer, McKay? The First Amendment. No. Oh, oh, oh. What about what about you, Casey? The Last Amendment. Sorry, but no. What about you, Keenan? Do you have an answer to this question? I'm sure you do. Well, yes. The Fourth Amendment protects against unreasonable searches and seizures. <laughs> Keenan, I don't know how you do this. You must be cheating or something, because that is correct again. Five points for you. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> Suddenlink is proud to support high school football in West Texas. Suddenlink, you're connected. And we're back. I'm your host, Mr. American History, here with Name That Mystery Document. And our sixth and final question of the day is... What are our unalienable rights? How about you, Casey? Do you have the answer to this one? The right to believe in aliens. No. How about you, McKaylee? An alien has rights? What? No. How about you, Keenan? Do you have an answer to this question? It's our human rights as humans for life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Yeah. Yes, you are correct again, Keenan. Congratulations, you are the champion on our game show. Name that document. Until next time, I'm your game host, Mr. American History. There's your champion, Keenan Judge. And I am signing off. See you again, folks. Looks like some people need to pay more attention in school. Yes, I agree. Let's hope our viewers pay attention to this.
Why is the Constitution of the United States so exceptional? Well, the difference is so small that it almost escapes you. But it's so great, it tells you the whole story in just three words. We, the people. Pretty amazing, huh? Our Constitution was actually signed and adopted on September 17th, 1787. That was 224 years ago. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everybody have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tiger.